Hey guys, it's Mike the Scrapper. I have a, an aluminum rim that I'm going to scrap. I'm going to show you how to do it if you don't have a one of those little tire machines to take off the uh, take off the rim. I'm going to show you how to do it with a uh, with a reciprocating saw. Now, this isn't really the blade to use. You need like a metal blade, a smaller one like this. This will actually work better. But um, I'm going to show you with a longer blade to cut time. <clears throat> what you want to do is you want to cut it first and cut the rim and then go to the other end and do the same thing and cut all the way to the rim. That way you can just take the tire right off. All right. Or you can just take it to your mechanic, pay him two, three dollars and he'll do it for you. All right. But <clears throat> for uh, scrappers that don't have that liberty, I'll show you how to do it with this. I already started a piece here, so we're just going to start from here. As you can see, I had to cut through the aluminum because the tire bead is down in here somewhere. Now, <clears throat> you want to wear gloves when you do this because of the steel that's inside. It will, you know, poke holes in your hand and in your fingers, and you don't want that. And that's what it looks like there. So now we're just going to cut the other end all the way down to the other end, and the tire should come right off. We're just going to fix it up a little bit, that way everything matches. And 95% of the time it should come off. This one I did it a little too fast, I don't think it's going to come off. I think I still have to chew a little bit deeper into the rim to get it out. As you can see, that cut right through. This the other side is not yet through, so I have to cut a little bit more. But look at that, it's only a few, it's only gonna take a few minutes, and you're gonna make some nice money doing it. And that's it. There you go. Now the tire, just take it to your local mechanic and have him dispose of it. Get to pay him like a dollar or something for the for the tire. And there you go. This room was no good. This room was damaged, just like that other one there. And these little plugs, there's actually brass there. So if you can scrap it for aluminum and brass, or just leave it as is. I think this piece might be plastic but um that's it you know one two three a few minutes make a few bucks these things are pretty heavy too you know so you're looking at some nice uh a nice meal for the day all right guys mike the scrapper comment subscribe like the page till then guys peace